Hello everybody and welcome back to episode 11, or no, episode 12, episode 12, it is episode 12 of the Digimon Cyber Sleuth LP. Uh, I'm Buddy Bison, and I just responded to uh, Gold Numemon, which is uh, one, it's like about halfway through what I need to get to the, get the XP Digimon, so I had to grind 200% Wanyamons, which are the cat ones, like Pete, and then... Uh, which wasn't too bad because Kowloon, Kowloon level 2 um, has them showing up easy. Okay. Uh, I said you don't smell them anymore. I'm just going around hitting X everywhere. Thinking that might. Okay, so this is cold. Is it working so late tonight? Um, I stand. Okay, so I'm guessing you know, maybe. I don't know because it doesn't seem to give any real indication. Is it you? Yep. Not go anywhere. Huh. Hmm, you're a tiny child. Call this a little kid. Don't call me a little kid, that's rude. Hey, wait a minute. You only spotted me here before, aren't you? Crap, how'd you notice me? You're not supposed to be able to see me at all. So that's what happened. Now, the assistant is so sensitive to digital waves and special networks. The couple didn't stand a chance to hide forever. He's a cyber... Uh, I'm a she. Excuse me. <laughs> Don't you see my flaming hot tatas? Uh, he's a... Cyrus Thu comes to the job. Not bad, we've got questions. Let me keep detective too. Whoa, you're so hot. <laughs> okay, we're just answering my questions already. I mean, yeah, honestly, with a shirt that just goes down halfway. I'm what we'd call a genius architect. I'm not some lowly hacker or programmer. <laughs> you know about the Baku Reborn service? It's a special service here on Eden. It's like where a user either permanently leaves Eden or they die. The Baku Reborn service gathers all the user's data and deletes it. I'm the one who runs it. Huh. You know, I have to ask this price. Kids are just more attuned to the digital world than adults. I just stayed on my own and joined groups that I could trade info with, and soon enough I started working in corporate R&D. Uh, well, the reason I'm going to say a genius isn't because, just because I'm also one of the who designed it. Actually, why well, I said about gathering and doing but I used an entire kit, and actually does more. Not only does it gather and accumulate data, it organizes it, uh, almost like it has a mind of its own. To be honest, even I'm surprised by that. I never expected to act so precisely and deliberately. It's a real case of creation, surpassing the creator, but that's how it should be with these sorts of things, no? I follow you. Bach refers to mythological future, consumers nightmares. And maybe because data won't we don't want to show online is very much some sort of nightmare. By using that background yourself, you could okay, no matter what you did now. You handed your own avatar service level appearance over to Bach and let consumer. Now we know Moran you would be able to know that you were lurking. You know that purge that data outright, you controlled it yourself, make it hand it back like a dog. Okay. All out. Yep, you got me. That's amazing, though. I love when I actually meet a smart adult. <laughs> I'm not happy with that <laughs> that sentence. I'm guessing you basically used the same trick to draw out his mental data then. Yeah, I copied it, but I only did that with her short-term memory, the stuff you'd find around a person's hippocampus inside a real brain. Even something that's advanced as Buck, you can't break into a person's memory with it with an active mental data. That would be that would definitely be crossing the line, and I don't understand why that's bad. And I no, and I understand why that's bad. No, don't. I'll hand over what I copy to your partner, given the apparent interest it sparked. It really is like a vacuum, isn't it? I think it's the best for the current situation. I am that I am not. I think that might be the best way to describe what your partner is to this world, if you catch my drift. No, I was thinking the same thing, genius or not. Even I can't purposely go out and architect life itself. That thing was probably born as such by pure chance. And before it, how it'll end up going moon. Okay. We really are smart. Sharp sure, words that I admire. Actually, let me deal with the Baku. You plan on disposing of it? Yeah. Depends on how things go. Trust your judgment. You want to upload it on site. The password lock is lifted. Leave it. Okay, cool. You're a nice guy. He's a culprit. I oh, you see. <laughs> wow, what did I do? What did I do? Why did I do what I did with her account? Who cares at this stage? Dude, yeah, I promised to you apologize for that, and you're some consolation. I suggest leave me alone. 
We might hear an E before, haven't we? Talk for a little bit while I was running me up to the front, right? How you feel? That means stuff. You're so smart. You shouldn't be out committing crimes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> shouldn't be committing crimes. You're a good kid. What are you staring at? Okay. You are a Baku reborn. Gonna resume our hunt now. Okay. Uh, kill it. Okay. So I want to capture it. Although I'm imagining it's going to be a fight normal. Go back. It's too dangerous for you to stick around. My assistant will take care of everything. Okay. Cool. I don't know how our prey is going to react once you get there. Prepare for anything. It's fine. I got some badass Digimon that aren't weak to anything but aren't particularly strong against anything. Although they do have, they still have the elemental typing. Um, oh, okay, cool. So before I do anything, I want to, uh, I want to go to Digilab, show you guys my Digibank, and also set the Digifarm to be doing some stuff. So, Farm Island 1, You'll see I have three gold Numemons right here. Uh, so I had to get three 200% Wanyamons, evolve them into Kudamon, which is the like rat-esque thing, like the ferret, and then evolve into this, which I believe I have to get to like level 45 or whatnot, uh, evolve it into Vademon, get that up to like 45 or something, to... Uh, get its skill, because it's just a good skill, and then go back down to this, evolve it into... I think I evolve into Platinum Numemon, and it has the support skill of giving more XP in battle, so I'm guessing you just, you would want to have like a party of this, these out, and then just go fight stuff. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to give it a command. Um, see, I'm wondering if this levels them up faster. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'll just pay 10,000 yen. See, see what goes on. I change the leader. Angemon, you're a builder. Let's do that. Yes. Unfortunately, I can't add any islands, so I can't have more people doing stuff. So, farm. So, now in the Digibank, I have Gurumon. Numemon, Starmon, Terrymon, Vimon, Jerugamon, which is one of the ones that I was grinding against. I have two of these guys. I have a normal Greymon, which is another one I was grinding against. I have pe two Peckmon, which is one of the ones I was grinding against. Um, yeah, and you can see that they only have the one scope because uh, I, they, didn't, they don't have any inherited skills yet. Um, but... That is beside the point. So now that I've done all that, let's leave. Back to here. So this is a jump up, so I have to go around. Uh huh. And I like a Stigmon, who runs like a Naruto character. Look at me, I'm running with my hands. Just Ooh, my, those are big. Uh, and they're data types, which unfortunately I do not have any particularly strong things against. Yeah. But, um. Yeah, let's try this. Okay. <laughs> what might actually happen is I might just, uh. I might just use auto battle to see how how it goes, because my Digimon are really strong, and really fast compared to these guys. So the only crappy part about Oppo is sometimes they'll just heal, <laughs> they'll use a heal move, it's not just attacking, <laughs> which kind of stinks, because as I said before, it just uses like the strongest attack available. Um, can I crack that one? Yes, I do. Because I have ultimates and whatnot. Which is nice. Got an emerald. And then wall crack too. Uh, I like being able to do this stuff now. The grinding is totally worth it in this game. Especially since it's not even... It, 
it's honestly just like a relaxation process. Ah, oh, yeah, now that thing's at 200. Uh, auto battle. Yeah, you can see that they're using moves, even though they really don't have to. <laughs> they just do this. They don't do like the smartest thing. They just do the strongest thing. Uh, I'm tempted to grind here. Well, grind out like the Digimon. I have two terminals at the beginning at the end, and only counter something once. Like I'm just tempted to like stay here and grind out the percentages on certain Digimon. I'm not sure how often I'll encounter them. Excuse <coughs> you! Uh, sorry about that, excuse me. Um, and, yeah, even Geo Greymon is, is vaccine type. So, honestly, it's one of the. Uh, let's see how this does. It's one of the less. It's just not very good right now. <laughs> because I don't have I don't have type coverage, I just don't have type. But luckily, because all my Digimon are like champion and ultimate and whatnot, like higher higher evol evolution. I don't really have to worry about them very much. Like and I did find out that there's a way for me to check how much camaraderie. I just hit triangle and look at their stats. So you can see camaraderie 100 near across the board. So the unfortunate thing about Stingmon and XVmon's evolution is because in the third series they were like best friends or whatever, uh, sti uh, they both require each other to be at 100% camaraderie to evolve. But if I evolve one of them, I won't meet the prerequisite for the previous one, so I can't evolve them both. I would have to get another Stingmon or another XVmon to evolve Stingmon or XVmon, <laughs> which is annoying. Uh, and I'm not sure who I will evolve, uh, because I don't know the stuff that happens. Hello. Hello, clock. One and only Baku, one who his program is merged with a wild Digimon. Baku slash Clockmon. Yep, you're a clock. Let's turn you. Okay, programs race where chase were left the Digimon's own sentience. Digimon are easily susceptible to influence from man made programs. It's one of the reasons why some don't consider them to be autonomous beings with their own sense of will. Okay, around this one, you're just gonna have to knock some sense into it. So it's interesting because they use the term sentient. Uh, which a lot of people uh, try and use. Oh, of course you're a data type, of course you're a data type. Um, which a lot of people use, but they don't understand that uh, sentience is only the ability to, like, feel. Like, animals are... Uh, animals are sentient. But uh, what most people try and say is sapient. Like, homo sapient. Be, uh, being a uh, sapient means you are capable of thinking, not not just feeling. So it's like a level above sentience. And I, when I learned that, I was like, oh, that's that's quite interesting. Uh, yeah, and you can see his stats are just awesome. Uh, and I have attack attach E and speed attach, uh, which is why he's also really good. Ooh, okay. Um, ripping net. Heal. Physical attack, 30 fire damage to everybody. Well, I guess I don't need to... It's only if the list fills out. I can figure it out later. And let's over, download the data, and collect what's left of Baku. Once you're done, get out of here. Come back to the office. Okay. Cool. Just auto-do that. It's hard to believe such a little kid who would do a heinous crime like that. Still shocked. Heinous. Guess this is where you're coming from. You didn't mean any harm by it. You certainly did. Broke the law. Hmm. All this in the past now, we've exercised your account of that little stalker that haunted it. The case is closed now. We we'll hound on to the black program in the meantime. If you can tune it up a bit, you can very well come in handy. You don't get it why you go after me in the first place. Do neither of you really get why that boy picked up? <laughs> Maybe there was really no reason not to say it was love at first sight. He really liked you. At first, he probably just wanted to get to know you with all his heart, but as we saw, he was less mature than he'd like to admit. 
wanted to tease and mess with you, so you pay attention to him. And his age is pretty standard mentality towards someone you like, really. Yeah. So fun, let me help out again. Someone else comes up. You'd be pretty cool to be a detective cat Digimon like that. Uh, I like how his name's Pete. <laughs> like everyone else, super Japanese names. Then Pete. <laughs> Are you still not able to actually leave the confines of nothing? Okay. Yeah, I think it has to do with how old the network protocols for the internet are. It makes it hard to transfer data around. Like stuck to the vacuum tube computer. Just like how back was that Digimon. Still much learn about what Pete truly is. What do we call Pete? Pete? Well, he's a cat. He's a chair from his own little time capsule where he's frozen all the time. Is that to open enough doors and you're bound to. Do you really need a reason for it? <laughs> Unlike the digital, the real is filled with with things that have no real reason for it being, okay? So, pleasure in life. So, yeah, just, he's Pete, because Pete, why not? Yeah, did the quest. Vanish the quest. Yeah, I got memory up. I'm gonna use that, get more memory. Okay, yeah, out. I'm thinking about it, we're out of beans. Could you pick up some more? I used them all crafting a new recipe yesterday. But first, I wanna get some more memory. Give me the memory. And I just went the long way around. Memory. Yeah, I'm at 45 now. Um, I'm trying to remember how much of my memory. 36 out of 45. Yeah. Okay, I need beans. Get me some beans. Oh, no. I'm a dumb. K Cafe. Beans. Beans, beans, the wonderful fruit. Which they are not, they're legumes. <laughs> Buying more beans already, I suppose with more employees, the spice used up that much faster. Come think of it, when you head back, when you buy some takoyaki from the third floor to go with your coffee. Only a child does no more than what they're asked, go above and beyond, and you'll seem quite clever. Okay. I'll go get some takoyaki. After this cutscene. Got coffee beans. How she create from these incredible beans that smell so good? <laughs> Hello, I know you. Hi, Yuko. Oh, you really want kakiyaki, huh? Don't you? You're hungry. You have some cravings. Oh, so much ellipses. I am more silent than you are silent. It's a poster on the wall you feel staring at. Nationwide B-level gourmet battle. Our restaurant becomes a culinary battleground. Grated yam ramen, tuna scraps, gyoza. Okay. That's what Yuko's looking at. Did I, did I hear her mouth watering over this? She did. Her mouth was... No, his mouth watered over it. Yep. Okay. And back to here. So I don't even get to buy Takayaki. No problem. Hello. You're back again. Your mouth watered, didn't it? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Just, it's rushing right that past that. Put that shit under the rug. This is our client. I'm going to investigate my father. The search continues. Kamishiro. Yeah, read chapter 5. I mean, my last year was reported in suicide. My father would never kill himself. Sorry for the outburst. Well, why do you think he wouldn't do it? Do you have some proof he wasn't suicidal? That's exactly what I found you. Well, what clues they may start with with Mikado Yamashina, who might have even investigated the other day. His research from Kamashina until last year, he left the company around the same time my father died, and then he disappeared. Simply, Yamashina is connected to your father's death. Okay. I'm know something about my father's death. Okay. Okay. That's nice. And more of the 
so few people who I can trust. I'm very sorry for my little ruse. I hope such an honest answer is proof that we have earned your trust. We shall investigate your father's death. Thank you so much. Please excuse me for a moment. Yeah, no problem. I'm alone. He's down right back to you. Okay, yeah. Something came up all of a sudden. You need to us. Thanks very much. Goodbye for now. This could turn out to be a really big case. We've got to go all out and solve it. If all goes well, we could expose Kamishiro's past along with the company's inner workings. I should ask Detective Matayoshi for his help. Started, What's NVNG? ダメ元。好きがよく使う。ご存知の通り、ダメでも友達の攻略された言葉だ。ダメでも友達の攻略された言葉だ。ダメでも友達の攻略された言葉だ。ダメでも友達の攻略された言葉だ。ダメでも友
Map. Nakano. Nakano, Nakano. See, it always irks me when I uh, hear, like, English dubs of, like, video games or anime, and they always say... I don't want to say that they say the town names or the people's names wrong, but it's just, like, you can definitely tell that it's not the same uh, annotation on certain syllables that is the way that it was intended to be said, really. Like, uh... Like, the ones that hurt me the most was when I was playing Persona 5 in the English dub. Uh, and, like, a lot of the names would be, like, messed up, because it would be like, Oh, uh, it's like, on uh, Takamaki, and they would go Takamaki. Or, like, uh, Ryuji uh, Sakamoto, and they'd go Sakamoto. And it's like, just listen to the Japanese dub and copy it. Like, you don't have to try and Americanize the way you say the, uh things. No, never heard of it. Third rate sweatshop. Okay, cool. Hello, you look like a businessman. Definitely nice. Hello. This company created to research the Eden Avatar system, isn't it? I think they were bought out by some big company a long time ago, though they aren't around anymore. Better head back to the office. Cool. Yep. Da -da. Log it. Hello there. Oh, Hello there. Yes, I am getting used to working as a detective. I mean, like, I'm not supposed to be here. We can't find a non corporation case for us. So that has some direct involvement with the case itself. Placing your find them, all the files are stored together at Kamshiro. Mishima had a went to but we had to leave the files there. This is the country years, isn't it? Such suspicions were raised that Kamshiro required a new corporation to listen. Father and I are investigating that when we ran into a little problem. The pressure coming down from up top, we were forced to abandon the case. The time we were also forced to hand over all case files to Kamshiro, too. Since we knew how bad it was, we decided to keep silent track of the case files were stored. We kept track even after we found the files away. The files were even stored deeper than the Avalon server, which is the main country though, so I'm gonna hack into it. Cool. Traced by the cyberspace country, confidential data. Right? Say I've kept track as long as I've confirmed the deal's location first hand. At best, it's conjecture based on info from scans of the environments. Caught my intuition? Good enough. That's how we had them return what they've been keeping for us. This cup shit. You had to get around the top of security of the world around the company with Digimon. We let's learn from the case of the drop in the store. We're gonna force our way through closed gates to open the strategy and have them open it for us. Is there an odd space between hey and now? I feel like there is. Looks like they hit space two times. Good protecting makes the impossible possible. Now you have the rooster own line up, so we're going to grow in just the way we need. They'll get to help us when it comes to the chain comes here. Speak of the devil, and the devil shall come. And your pardon. Hello. It's again, we're out of time. In progress. You don't mean the former presidents. Question if she were to walk into corporate HQ. Don't even introduce yourself. Just ask for help. You don't know me, but we need your help. It's like a movie plot. I see. When you say we really need your help with the investigation. That's fine. One of the last suspicions are correct after all. Or as well. But I'm a minor, and as such, my authority within the company is rather restricted. I doubt I'll be able to do much more than get you into the lobby of the main office. If you think about this, if I'm writing friends from school to take a tour, it shouldn't be an issue getting you into the lobby, I think. I recognize this too. If you get my assistant in, that'd be terrific. Can you manage that? Okay. Finally, music again. Interesting. We're a world class hacker, I doubt it's even possible. Yeah, I'm. Guess we're lucky I'm a cyber sleuth. 
Maybe the domain of cybers that think to us. Good thing I can literally just go into a computer. I'll go and set things up. So where where do my Digimon just stay while I'm not there? Do they stay at like the Digibank area? Or are they just in my like watch? And we're actually gonna do again, I have an idea actually. Uh, this one case we're gonna hands on the program. Think of having it customized for my assistant. With the help of someone I know. So we can start with the preparations. Once your assistant starts by hitting you, Amy, Cockroach, please. Well, you're coming in while you can get the details from her. Okay. So I need to go to Mirai's place. Let's check Digiline. Uh, it's why I'm correct. Yeah, of course I'm correct. Friends, I've entrusted your dreadful task to your turn at once. No need to worry. Don't worry about it. I, I got it. I got it, man. There's no problems. No problems whatsoever. Okay, so before I go to Mireille's place, I'm going to end this episode here. And we'll come back to it. So, I hope you all have a very nice day.